Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back out to Jan McDonald Field here on the campus of North Greenville University, where Christ makes a difference. Got a soft Thursday afternoon softball doubleheader here for you as the 16 and 10 North Greenville University Lady Crusaders looked at a couple more wins to their resume as they get ready to take on the 1 and 13 Piedmont International University Bruins out of Winston Salem, North Carolina. Natalie Jones batting eighth. And Coffrin gets Price to swing over the top of it, one away, getting swept by Limestone. And strike three, Coffrin will put Cook away on three straight. And now the 2-2 from Coffrin, chased it up high, strike three. Coffrin strikes out the side, and the Bruins go down in order, one, two, three. See if McGee can get some consistency going. Swung on down low in the zone to short. Throw over to first in time to retire Withers. But Haley Gray will score from third. And North Greenville takes the early lead, 1-0. Yeah, but it's not stopping our Lady Crusaders from cheering on the team. And I mean, it... Well, Griffin's going to golf one down low in the zone. Send it to left field. And it's going to hang up and be caught. And scoring from third is Stone to make it 2-0, and the Bruins have two away. And we'll swing underneath that one, and Coffrin sits the shortstop down on three straight. And the one-two. Called strike three. Coffrin only one ball in the three batters that she's faced. And strike three. It's getting really windy out here. Mm, boy, that's a strong one. <laughs> no runs, no hits, no errors. Coffrin again strikes out the side. The 0 1 lined into right center field. That'll drop. Lee takes a turnaround third, heading for home. The throw late. And he makes it to home. And advancing to second on the throw is Taylor Coon. And dusted for three straight. Strike three, one away. Count evened up, one away, the 2-2. Two -two. Called strike three. Two away for Coffrin on the season for Piedmont International. And swings at the first pitch to shallow left. And the first out that isn't a strikeout is recorded. Kelsey Rivers makes the grab. McGee offers, and a hard hit ball in the left center field. Back to the fence and off of it. That's going to score Stone. Here comes Griffin around first to second, and she finally gets that double. And she'll tack on a run. It's 5 nothing. Coffin will try again, the 1-2. Offering. Called strike three. Thank you guys. And that'll do it for game one. Coffin with 16 strikeouts. Shuts out Piedmont International, and no runs, no hits, no errors. Nobody left on for the Bruins here at the end of game one.